All right, let's go back to Edna and see if we can get those lyrics. Hey. Oh. Nice suit. Where'd you get it? Costume shop at the mall. <laughs> uh, I, I had it custom made. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Quality material. Yeah, see? Who are you? Where are you from? The name's, uh, Michael Corleone. <laughs> I'm one of you, see, man. I'm one of you guys. Don't you recognize me? No. Uh, Come on. What's the deal? That's because I'm not from around Stay here. Or I'll go easy, I'm kid. out of town. From the cut of the suit, I'm thinking he might be with the Valenti gang. Yeah. Is that so? Yeah, see? Uh, yes? Prove it. You ain't leaving till you show me some boner fides. <laughs> all right. Well, before I do that, I just realized I forgot to talk to this guy, as well as look at all the Louis rest of the, the other Lass, characters. Squashed in his prime. Character. <laughs> caricatures. Bucktooth Langley. Bit off more than he could chew. Ha uh ha. -huh. Chuckles Lenart. He didn't get the last laugh. Alright, let's talk to Zane. Hey, bartender. What'll it be? <laughs> Man, give me... <laughs> uh, about those characters. So about this, uh, portrait gallery of yours. What about it? What's it all about? Who are those guys? Yeah. <clears throat> the caricatures hanging along the Wall of Honor commemorate those who are no longer with us on account of having ticked off one Irving kid, Tannen. Guys he whacked. Are the guys the kids killed? Well, of course not. <laughs> They're just a bunch of guys that kid didn't particularly like and that at a later date turned up dead. Yeah. It's a, a what do you call it, a, a circumstantial coincidence. Yeah, yeah. sure it is. What are you drawing, by the way? What are you drawing? Another celebrity caricature. You drew those? <laughs> Prohibition ain't gonna last forever, Bob. I gotta have a skill I can fall back on when all this goes away. Huh. How about you draw me? Think you could do a caricature of me? Sure. <laughs> Presto! Ah, not bad. It really doesn't look like me. What? I didn't have much to work with. It does look like you. What are you talking about? Hey, can you help me out with Parker? Got any tips for getting Parker in the right frame of mind? Well, I ain't no Carl Jung, but uh, I've noticed that when he's boozing it up like he is tonight, Danny Boy's particularly receptive to the lyrical stylings of Miss Trotter. Okay, so huh? that would have been like a hint yeah. if Some if guys you are inspired by great works of art, others get their ideas from lounge singers. Go figure. <laughs> Alright, what, what about you? So is your cold all better? My cold? Yeah, when I saw you a few hours ago, you were sneezing like crazy. No, you didn't see him a few hours ago, Marty. Come on. Oh, yeah, right. Sorry. Wrong guy. Ugh, Marty, sometimes. Sometimes. What can you tell me about Trixie? You trying to put the moves on kids, Dame? No way. Uh, it Good, said skirt, if you did, not Dame. I'd probably be hanging <laughs> you on the wall of honor. Know what I mean? Yeah, I know what you mean, man. Thanks for the talk. Next time, order a drink. This ain't no library, you know. Okay. <laughs> well, he drew me. How about I have him draw my dad? You think you could draw a picture of this guy? Sure. Hey, that looks like that Artie McFly think. Hmm, I never noticed that before. Hey, uh, can you give him a hat like Artie wears? Should I come back for it? Huh. Suit yourself. <laughs> That's gonna take him an extra long time. Okay. All right. Well, in the meantime, let's uh, give kid. Let's show him that uh, <laughs> this lighter. The name is Scaramanga. Francisco Scaramanga. I've got a little something here that might convince you. <laughs> uh oh. Don't even blink. It's not a real gun. It's not a real gun. I swear. It's a gift from Don Valenti. See? Yeah, take a look at it. To your family from mine, in gratitude for your continued service, J.J. Valenti. Huh. Looks like little Mikey Corleone here really is with the Sacramento boys. Yeah. You got stones, Pee-wee. I like that. Have yourself a drink on the house. Matches, put down your gun. You look like a moron. <laughs> <sighs> yourself. All right, now, why don't we go talk to Kid? Hey, kid. What is it, Squirt? Hey, uh, about your operation here. It's good to see you doing so well. The boys down in Sacramento were starting to get worried. With all due respect, the boys down in Sacramento can bite me. Huh. When that creepy Sagan guy burned down my speakeasy, did the Sacramento boys lift a finger to help me back on my feet? No. Well... And when that weasel accountant McFly went and blabbed to the feds, 
Did the Sacramento boys help me get rid of the well, evidence? Well, no. Yeah. Uh, I, I had to put <laughs> three more cops on my payroll to pull that one off. <laughs> okay, but... But nothing. When you get back to Sacramento, you let J.J. Valenti know that Kid Tannen expects a little more respect for his efforts in the future. Understand? No problem, kid. Yeah, you got it, man. And what about that wall of fame you got? What's that wall of fame all about? That, my tiny friend, is where I pay tribute to fallen foes. Cut short in the prime of life before I had a chance to cut it short myself. Huh. They're the guys you've whacked. Whacked? <laughs> uh, rubbed out. Not many legally actionable sense, no. Whacked. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I forgot that he said that. <laughs> nice club. That's a nice place you got here. Ain't it? I picked out all the statuary myself when I was traveling through Greece. <laughs> I can tell. It's got that tan and touch. Thanks. About Trixie. How long have you and Trixie been going out? You mean knocking boots? <laughs> oh, about a year now. <laughs> That's a long time. Tell me about it. I keep meaning to dump her for a newer model. <laughs> then she starts singing at me, and I remember why we got together in the first place. Love? Free nightclub entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Typical tannin. See ya, kid. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Man, yeah, whatever. Man. Yeah. I'll mess with that later. Alright, let's head back out. Hey, it's Ari! He's back. Okay, remember that pipe I got? Actually, hold on, let me see. Uber 28. Ah, I already looked at that. Thought we'd look at a different poster. Okay. Let's see if I can get that song, a copy of that song from, Ed, from uh, Edna. Edna, what? Can I have a copy of your song? Do you think I could have a copy of your You Should Care lyrics? I've uh, got a club of my own that could really use some inspiring. <laughs> sure, let me just get a page out of the hymnal. <laughs> there you are. Hey, thanks. Uh, bring kid to justice. Couldn't kid be brought up on other charges like, say, running a speakeasy? In a perfect world, yes. But no one in town seems to care about prohibition anymore. Huh. The feds are only interested because of the lost tax revenue. Of course they are. Ah, uh, them and their taxes. You know, Trixie Trotter sings a song that sounds a lot like your You Should Care. She does? Yeah, but hers is a little more carefree. That's what you get when you sing for booze hounds and gangsters. Yeah. See ya. Keep fighting the good fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's, uh... Actually, hold on a second. Yeah. There he is. Hey, Einie. Find him for me, boy. Hey, boy. Take a whiff of this. Gotta love that nose. <laughs> he's in the theater. I guess he's seeing Frankenstein. I've been laying low, officer, but I've got to go to the pictures once in a while. Hello, Arthur. Huh. Officer? I'll Doc take it must from have here, seen me and look. Einstein heading to the theater. You're talk of the majestic, away from prying eyes. Okay, well, we found him. Good boy. Yeah, Einstein, you done good. That'll do. That'll do. I. That'll do. <laughs> okay. Let's go head up and talk to them. Hey, Doc. I could use a little help. What's the problem? <laughs> uh, where do I?